Hello everyone, my name is Guchimus, and welcome back to Your Turn to Die, Death Game by Majority. So, in the last episode, we had a Trial 2 practice round, and my god, they just keep throwing all these mini-trials at us. We got Trial 1, Trial 1.5, now Trial 2 practice round, all of which people can just die in. So, you know... I don't even know what to say about this, guys, besides someone should probably drag these children away from the dead body. How about the police officer who's just standing here? Let's give him a talking to. Kenji seems to be in thought. Uh, everyone went outside, huh? They all need time to think right now. So do you, Sarah. Me too, of course. I'm sure everyone will come back. Yeah. Here's hoping. Let's uh, try to talk to the kids, see if we can drag them away from the dead body. Nao is sitting by the professor, dumbfounded. Jin, I know how you feel, but you shouldn't be here. J just a little longer, meow. It was just for a little bit, but we were searching together, Wolf. Jin. Yeah, I hear you, man. Well, anything else to do in this hellhole? Oh, God. Then I know who you feel. Okay, the same thing. Alright, well, guess we got no choice but to back out to the cafeteria. And then we'll go back to the cafeteria itself. Yeah. Let's see, who's this Kai? Kai's staring directly at the kitchen. It is locked. Perhaps there is nothing to be done. Kai. Uh, I'm not gonna ask what he's plotting. I want to be insidious, or insinuous, whatever. The, however you say that. What are you doing? I was thinking of ways to enter the kitchen. It has not yet been checked, you see. You're so calm. Man, my cat's going crazy over there. Jeez. Chill out, Zero. Goddamn. Is this person really my stalker? That's what I want to know. You don't seem very sure about that yourself. I thought if he was a stalker, he'd be with the kidnappers. But when he hit Miley... I sensed undeniable hostility. Yeah, that was a pretty serious hit. She didn't look like no robot to me. Kai was angry. Miss Sarah. Er, Kai, are you? Whoa. Okay, okay. What's happening? Uh, the lights. Okay, the lights went out. Miss Sarah, are you alright? I'm fine. It may be a trap. Let's look for the switch. Yeah. It's, it's this. Something's glowing. Uh, I just, I just want you to look at it. There are glowing letters using fluorescent paint. They're on some sort of paper. Ooh, I don't like this. It's a card. When who claims this, this now belongs to you. Keep it on you always. This is a key to the exit. Let no one else know the existence of this card, otherwise you will die? Aww. Oh, I just got the key to the exit? Really? The one who claimed... Oh yeah, I just read that. That belongs to you. Yeah, I just read it. What is this? Oh shit, put it away. Miss Sarah, are you unharmed? I hid the card before I could even think. I'm okay. Looks like the lights came on. Let us look at the other rooms. See if anything occurred in that moment. Yeah. Oh, look at the text. I already saw the text, and I look at the back. Yeah, we looked at the front, and the text was gone. Low in the dark paint? Okay. On the back, the card was... On the, of the card was a strange image. 
Keymaster. The other text seemed to disappear, so what does Keymaster mean? If I don't follow those rules, I'll die? I feel like I'm being led by them again. Yeah. There's no way this card's a good thing, right? Just definitely don't let anyone else know you have it, probably. I believe the part about me dying, if anybody else, so... Uh, you know. Yeah. Anywho. Where do I go now? Central Hall, I guess. Whoa! Staircase! What is that? Where nothing had been before, now there were stairs. Is this another trap? Uh, it doesn't look like a trap to me. I'm gonna talk to Kutara. I don't trust Sue. Now when this get here? Don't tell me these stairs lead to... The main game ground. Shit. Of course it is. Don't know about that, but whatever the case, bet we gotta go. Damn it, it's just gonna be a trap anyhow. What do you think, Sarah? Everyone on everyone's on edge right now. If we go, we should get everyone together first. Well, you heard about the main game, right? We're gonna pick one of us to die? Of course, I don't want to take part in it, but how are we supposed to feel any unity? Serious. Like, if we all tie in the main game, will we all die? Yeah, because it said just because it's a practice round, if everyone ties, you won't die. Kind of heavily implied that it won't be the case in the main game. You might have a point, but... Damn it. Alright, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna try and believe in you. We'll go up here when everyone's assembled. Anybody tries to go up on their own, I'll catch them but good. All right, good on you, Katar. Please don't be rough, okay? Yeah. Just stop, Sue. He's the one I worry about. Look, Miss Sarah. There are stairs here now. Wonder where they lead. I don't know, but... Miley left a few spots of blood. I'm sure she went up there. Miley! Uh, did anyone else go up? I only just got here, so I don't know. Has anyone else gone missing? Shit. Can't imagine anyone would go up these stairs on their own, but... You aren't thinking of going up, are you, Miss Sarah? I'm telling you, for your own good, you should refrain for now. Yeah, I wasn't going up yet. More importantly, there's something I want to show you. Eh? Come to the back of the cafeteria, please. Okay. Ah, Sue! I wonder what he wants to show me. That is a good question. I guess we'll go to the cafeteria then. But actually, maybe I should take a look around. Make sure nobody's creeping around anywhere. Like in the game room, I suppose. No, oh, there's no one here. Okay, that makes sense. Why would they be here after all? And there is still the red room. You know, that's not just gonna go unused. Uh, Central Hall, of course, of course. Now let's go to the cafeteria. Uh, back of the cafeteria. Is this door unlocked now? No, it's still shut fast. Uh, oh, back of the cafeteria in the pink room. Gotcha. Right, Sue told me to come here, but... Miss Sarah, this way, this way. I'm over here. What? Sue, is that you? I held a lighter in the direction of his voice. Whoa! Secret door! A door? I think this was here. So wait. So we came to the cafeteria when our game game 1.5 was going down, right? That's kind of weird. Alright, let's go into the hidden room. See what's going on. I just don't trust Sue, you know? I just don't. Dark, isn't it? The only light is from that stand. What did you want to show me in this place? Check what's on the desk. 
It looks like a... Is that a laptop? There's something placed on the desk. It's a laptop computer. Very intriguing, right? I did try starting it up. There's no power cord, but it seems to be running on battery power. So once the battery's dead, it's over. Want to investigate? Want to investigate what's on it? But right. Uh. Yeah, this might be a trap too. I'm aware of that, but we can't not investigate it, you know. However, there's a problem. This laptop is locked with a password. So you can't see what's stored on it. I tried some random passwords, but that but all I accomplished was draining the battery. Yeah. You got any ideas? Uh, let's see. Kidnappers organization sounds pretty good. Like we have to figure out who they are. Birthday, maybe. Any day. Anyone's birthday. Sound right. And someone's name. Someone's name is probably the right answer, isn't it? I'm gonna go with someone's name. Yeah, that a kidnapper's organ. Ah, someone's name. <laughs> That's a possibility. And if it opens with someone's name, there's a good chance they're the laptop's owner. That's a good point. That's a good point. But if it's a name we don't know, there'd be no way for us to learn it. That's so true. The best if we could just conveniently find a piece of paper with the password. Yeah, that'd be nice. Now that would definitely be a trap. Yeah. Hmm. If we just had a hint. Ah. A hint, huh? Maybe this is a hint from the kidnappers. What do you mean? There's probably some information on here that's valuable to us, but worthless to them. Solve the riddle and we'll genu <laughs> generously give it out. If you can't, it doesn't matter to us like that. Yeah, it could just be completely useless information as well. And we can't see it once the battery goes dead, so it's like a time-limited treasure chest. I might want to turn it off. I can't see them being that kind, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna stay here and work on figuring out the password. Miss Sarah, tell me if you find any clues. I shouldn't get too hopeful. I need, do need to have hope and keep my head up. Until the battery runs out, maybe Sue will be able to keep his head up too. Yeah. Hard to see in the dark, but there are bookshelves. They've got proper covers, but they're all blank notebooks on the inside. Kenji was saying there might be a meaning to the ordering of the books, though. Kenji came here too? Did he? Why didn't either one of them mention this shit? Oh, no. Well, maybe they just didn't have a chance. I don't think about it. I didn't really see Kenji during the like investigation portion, did I? I'm just clicking around. Alright, well, I'm not seeing anything else I can click, so. Uh let's go into the hidden room and see. Oh no, not the hidden room, the pink room. See if everyone's still moping. Yeah, they are. Hey Kenji. Kenji seems to be in thought. Uh, I'll just stand silently this time, I guess. I don't know. I already talked to him, so it seems the same. <sighs> okay, but, um, actually, I should talk to the other two just to make sure I don't need to talk to them right now. Yeah, okay, that's the same. Never mind. Uh, let's see. Back to the cafeteria. Where's Kana, I wonder? Seeing her. Large staircase leading up. Yeah, where's Kana? Maybe like they're all not gonna be able visible to talk to right away or something, I don't know. 
go to the bar. Oh, there they are. Here, wipe it off with this. Thank you very much. Damn puppet. If, as if you even got a change of clothes. You too. Ah. Anna looked at me with very surprised eyes. They weren't the trusting eyes she'd had. Oh shit. I. Oh, I didn't mean to. I didn't want to lie to her. I didn't want to lie to her. Come on. Should I have come up with like. Maybe if I said. Ah. Maybe she would have just came up with the excuse on her own if I said it wasn't her fault. But I thought like she was just going to try and bullshit her or something. I have no idea. Because of that lie, I deeply wounded Kana's heart. Sister killer. It's all because Miley said that awful thing. Ah, uh, maybe I should have just handed it off to Joe. Maybe that was the right option after all. Oh, for fuck's sake. Hey, Sarah, you think you could look for something Kana could wear? No problem. Alright, well, for fuck's sake. Try and do the right thing. This is what happens. What's wrong, Joe? Joe sits alone, hanging his head. So we left alone, huh? Uh... Uh... Let's just talk to him, man. Let's just have her. Joe, can we talk a little? Jeez, didn't I tell you to leave me alone? Oh, he did say that, didn't he? I guess I'm just nosy. It's kind of calm in here somehow. Wonder why. I've never had a drink in my life. Oh my god. I gotta take this away. Sorry. I'll play with it more later. Hey, Sarah? You really think Kenji's a cop? Oh. Um, I mean, there's a lot of different kind of cops. Eh? Joe, have you been doubting it this whole time? I mean, I just wanted your opinion, Sarah. I... Oof. God damn. I just want to say, I think he's a cop, but at the same time, I kind of think he's lying. <laughs> I don't want to sow more distrust between people, though, you know? I'm just going to say I think he's a cop. There's a lot of different kind of cops, you know? He could be some glorified paper pusher. He said he shot somebody, though, and he killed him, though. Oh, fuck. Sure, he's a cop. Huh? Right, okay. Damn, I'm a loser, aren't I? Just a little difference of opinion got me uneasy. Me, I can't think there's someone siding with the kidnappers among that bunch. Huh? Now that's strange. Wasn't Joe the first one to suggest there was? Yeah... The more I try to believe, the more suspicious I get. Listen, Sarah. Could you look into Kenji a little? Me? Nah, sorry. Pretend I never asked. Because he wants to believe. He suspects. One thing's for sure. It's better if we know more about each other. Or my own survival, too. Oh, fuck. Okay, let's just relax. Sarah's having an anxiety attack. Sarah? It's nothing. What am I thinking? Leave it to me, Joe. Are you serious? Don't push yourself too much, Sarah. Alright. Yeah. Uh, I might be taking the game a little too lightly. Yeah, leave him be now. Alright, we're done in here. Goddamn. I wanted to tell her the truth for fuck's sake. Poor Kana.
Uh, where to now? Uh, smoke and I. Yeah, hallway. Anyone in the game room now? I think I talked to everyone, didn't I? Is the blue room still? What? Yeah, who? What? Is that Kana? Kana's sitting in the chair. Weren't you? You were just. Huh? This is. A doll? A doll? Why is there a doll of Kana? I can't see the parts hidden under clothes, but everything seems disturbingly detailed. Football? On the doll's hand is written, please use as you wish. As I wish. Take off the clothes. Why would I take off the clothes? I'm moving it. Take off the clothes is such a weird option that I got a feeling it's the right one. Okay, take off the clothes. Even the clothes look exactly the same. Strip the doll's clothes. Alright. Even if it's dull, it feels awkward to leave it here. Place Kana's doll in a discreet spot. Sorry, Miss Doll. Oh, yeah, I need clothes. Of course. Of course. Of course. But. So, moving, I can move the doll just fine. Oh, moving it, I did move it. Though. Why is there a doll of Kana here? It's because she peed herself, right? They're like, yeah, I guess they're not complete assholes. That doll moved, though? Are they gonna start moving? Well, it's naked now. Sarah, you find anything Kana could wear? I found this in the blue room. What? Ain't this the exact uniform? Creepy. The hell they got stuff like this prepared. Thank you very much. Kinda looks even more feeble. Ah, uh, I mean, that worked last time, but now she thinks we're a liar. She she responded to it fine before, so I'll try again. Anna. Knock my hand away in surprise, yep. Fuck. Hey, Kana, easy now, what's up? I'm sorry. Please, don't be nice to me anymore. I'm afraid of having hope. Oh, fuck, now she's running away. Sarah, hey, what's the deal? Uh, I mean... I can't. Just keep silent. I gotta tell her. I'm scared. I'm sure Rico will tell me when I have told the truth then. I should have told the truth then. I tried! Fuck you. But I... Sarah, look me in the eye. Don't sit there and brood over crap. Eh? Talk to me, or are you just not listening to what I say? I understand. Mishima said that? Uh, my fault, I guess. I went along with it, you know. Cut it out! Don't say that shit! Did you mean to hurt her? Of course not, right? It's true. <clears throat> sure, Mishima was the first to lie, and I don't know if that was right or not. But guess what? There's hope in Kana's eyes. You know how hard it is to show hope to a person whose heart's been snapped? Damn it. Why? Why'd I go call him Mishima a nutty professor? Rico. You voted for him, didn't you? Guess it ain't fair to decide he's no good. 
Just cause he's a man. Yeah, that's kind of fucked up. I get the stitch now. I'll back Kana up, Sarah. It's what we do now that's important, right? Yes. Yeah. Oh boy. Shit's getting very dramatic. Uh, back to central, I guess. We should probably find Kana. She just kind of ran off. Where to now, though, I wonder? Cafeteria. Going back to the room. Back to the pink room. Oh, they're just sitting in here, really not doing anything. Hmm. Well, let's try these locked doors, I guess. Kitchen's still shut. Large staircase. Uh, you got anything to say, bro? Anything new? We'll go up the stairs when everyone's assembled. Can't imagine we'll be able to act all friendly like before, though. Yeah. Well, we literally have to vote for someone to die. Like, who would we even vote for right now? And I like, I like everybody. Let me just vote for Kana. <laughs> That'd be so, so fucked up. Uh. Well. Can we get a smoke? I need a smoke. Yeah, okay, fine. Game room? Okay, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Was there just a figure there? Yep. The seemingly locked red door is now open. Okay, yeah, let's just go in by ourselves. Fuck it. The lights again. E what in the world is happening? Ah. Uh... Hurry and leave, call out for somebody. <sighs> Hurry and leave, I don't, I just don't like it, I wanna look around, so I'm gonna call out for somebody. Somebody there? I'm uneasy about acting alone, I might wanna head back for now. Turned around and found the door had shut. Yep. Phone open, I've been locked in. Ooh. Here, what is that? Water? Notes of some kind are scattered about. 6.6% Alice. Yasu Ebasame. 5.3 Renaru Giyama. 4.9 Megumi Sashahara. 3.0 Kazumi Mishima. How many of these people do we know? Only. Do you know Alice? Yabusame is Kana's. That's Kana's sister. I don't know this person. I don't know this person, but Mishima. It's odds on us. Professor Mishima's name is on this, along with some people I don't know. Hmm, Alice Yabusame. I'll hold on to this. Ain't torn paper. Damn. That's true, then Kana's sister, if it was. Can we go in here? The glossary? No, not. Well, we can, but it doesn't give me anything useful. Um, yeah, she had probably, if there's a 20%, she had like the best chance of winning probably out of everybody. Maybe. Large teddy bear. A box that has a lid affixed with some screws. Uh, it's just the teddy bear again. Candle. Books in the books in the uh, bookcase. The covers look proper, but they're all blank on the inside. Can we light the candle. I oh, light the candle. The lighter ran out of fuel. Shit. Whoa. Large teddy bear. That's shaking its head. Lock with no hands. Bookcase. Oh, blank on the inside. Why is that shaking? 
What is the frame are held in by screws and nails? So is that like some kind of secret passage? It's a bottle. There's water inside. Obtain the bottle. Ooh, the bear's crying blood. Red liquid leaks from the teddy bear's eyes. Eh? Lock with no hands. I don't have to do it. Where are the water? What this? Box on top of the bookcase that looks like it needs both hands to carry. Ugh, just barely too high to reach. Anything I can use to get a boost? Table? Use the desk to get a fucking boost, would you? Um, well, if you're unwilling to do that, I'm not sure what to tell you. What am I doing here? Oh, okay. Um, she's using the books to get up there. Okay. This'll do. Able enough to stand down. Okay. Checking the box. There's a box on top of the bookcase. Looks like it needs both hands to carry. Look inside. And two needles. Water, needles. I mean, that's kind of what you need to make a compass, right? Am I making a compass? These are large and long. That's dumb, right? No. That's the freaking uh, clock with no hands. I got hands free now in the form of needles. Yes. Ooh, where should I put the hour hand? Uh, I don't know yet. Hold on. No, I don't know. 28? I, I don't know yet. For fuck's sake, let me go back. All right, well, I guess we'll go to eight. Nothing's happening. Okay, hint somewhere in the room. Yeah, there's a clock right here. 2875. 2875? How's that a hint? I mean, 2 plus 8 is 10, 7 plus 5 is 12, I guess? We'll try that, 10, 12. Nothing's happening, fuck. Okay. Ah, starting to feel dumb now, now the game's making me feel dumb. 75. That has to be the clue, right? What does it mean? What does it mean? Why did I get water? Use water on the bear? Why do I have water? Why do I hear that dripping sound? Sign so I can't carry it, okay. Um, 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 trying to combine items here, it's not really working. Um, screws, needles, hand, I mean, 2875, okay. Probably isn't a hard puzzle, I'm just probably overthinking it. 2875. I guess if you were to like go over the time, maybe it would be, if it was a 24 hour clock, it would be 4.15. 4.15 is a possibility. Nothing's happening. You can see a digital clock. Yeah, I already know. I already know that, but. I have a feeling this is something that may not be my country's time, the way we do things. And it's probably like a little different, maybe. Hmm. 875. What does that mean? What does that mean? I already tried adding them together. Alright. Oh, but I use the actual numbers, so maybe if I try 10. 
Oh wait, 75 though. That would just be 12 and I can't point the 12. Point to like 3. Nothing's happening. There's a clock in the bookcase, only 28.75, but... Display 28 on clock, that would be 4 o'clock. You displayed a 28 hour clock? There... Are there 28 hour clocks? Now I'm lost. Now I'm just lost. 28 hour clocks? What the hell is 75 then? I'll just say 9. 9 sounds right. Seventy-five minutes converts to one hour and forty minutes. But basically, I bet I need to configure this clock to read five fifteen. I don't get how the first part is. All right, whatever. You know what? He gave it to me. I'm happy with that. Ah, damn time puzzle. As the pendulum started to move, something inside fell out. And a tool, Phillips screwdriver, alright. Let's use a screwdriver on the picture. They are held in by screws and nails. All of them are different type. I, is that the idea? That I need four different tools to remove the painting? Eesh. Really? Yeah, I got that. A box has a lid affixed with screws. Could probably open it with a flathead screwdriver. Oh, I don't have it. I got a Phillips. What do I do with a Phillips then? Red liquid. Yeah, I got that. Why is this puzzle making me feel so dumb? I have no idea. Box on top of the bookcase. At least I can use both hands. Two needles were. Oh yeah, that's where the needles were. Let's try, let's try using this on everything. Candle is lit. So I can't carry it. Well, what if I... I can't combine. It's not letting me. Anything else on the desk. Lock is working quietly. Do I have anything to wipe it? I don't want to wipe it with that. I'll wipe it with the other paper I picked up. It doesn't seem very useful. I think it is. But hey. Oh, there was two papers. Right, right, right. The bear's tear stopped. Hmm, something came out of its mouth. Same tool, flathead screwdriver. Okay, now we got the flathead. Now we can open that bitch. Box has a lid, flicks with some screws. I'll use the flathead. Open the box. There's another tool. Allen wrench. And the lights are going out. Whoa. Why is the room bleeding? Why is there blood on the ground? Red liquid drops onto the floor. Shit. Um. I'm going to use an Allen wrench on. Yeah, I need four different tools. I'm running. What am I missing here? Little clock in the back of the bookcase. Okay, well, I can't do anything to that. Red liquid. If I jam a tool between the tiles, I can open it. Open up the floor. Perfect. Red liquid spreads beneath the floor. Can I dump water in it? If I pour water to increase the water volume. Hmm, something floated at the top. A, little, a small vial of water did that, huh? Okay. Something floats in the red liquid. Would prefer touching the liquid, no doubt. And a tool, nail puller. Sweet. Okay, now we can get out of here. Corners of the frame are held by screws and nails. Okay, I have all the four tools I need. I'll remove these. Remove the painting. Ooh. Whoa. The wall. Okay. A single tall locker. Open it? Yeah.
Fuck it. Getting a bad feeling, oh no. Calm down, Sarah. I'll open it. Who the fuck are you, man? Yeah! Ugh. Ooh, this fucker is sinister looking. Oh, he is not happy with me. Oh, help. What? Ah, what? That's what I'm saying. What the fuck is happening? Um. What should I do? Look at him at least, fuck. Nothing left in the locker. Look at the man. Are you alright? He's not conscious. What do I do? Should I run before he wakes up? I can't. I don't know if he's a good person, but he said help. Then, I'll take him with me. <laughs> Great lengths, I got the man on my shoulder. He doesn't seem to be hurt, but I should be delicate. Wow. Can we get the fuck out of here now? Taro, man. Ah, Sarah! Wait, what the? Who's that? Suddenly fainted as soon as he saw me. Joe, give me a hand. Got it. Let's carry him to the others. That was the plan. Alright, let's go. Uh, hallway. And the hall. Everyone should be here, right? Nope. Taro, help. Hey, what the hell's with this guy? He lost consciousness. I don't know, nothing. Have, have someone check him. Or, have somebody who'd know check him. Alright, well, I thought you'd be a little bit more helpful. Go to the bar. Alright, now we're in the bar. Let's go to the hall. Oh, what am I doing? I need to go to the cop, of course. Go to the cafeteria. And go to the back. And go to the hidden room. Not the hidden room, god damn it. I've been doing that like a million times. Go to the pink room. Hmm? Sarah, is that? Huh? What the hell is this about? Who's this guy on his shoulder? Lend me a hand, please, you see? I told him what happened in the red room. Relax, he's just faint. Who in the world is this guy? He's got a collar. Collar. Oh, shit. Oh, it technically means he's on our side. Why? Man! I don't know about that. Eh. I don't see any reason to tie him up. Would be nice. It's a friendly neighborhood policeman, though. I'm worried about how we haven't seen him before. That's true. Was he in the red room this whole time? We saw someone go in there, Sarah. It'll be hard to figure out if his, situa his situation until he wakes up. As long as he doesn't move, should be fine. Once he's up, let's leisurely question him. Yeah. Plus, there's a dead body in here, so. As I felt a little bit of relief. My attention unavoidably turned towards the situation in the room. Ah, Kenji. Arneo and the girl, and Jin still. Yeah, still the same as ever. Damn, it moved an inch. Hurts me to see it too. I want you to fucking take him somewhere, man. Kenji. Do you want to investigate? Well, yeah. It's hard, but someone's gotta do it. I just so happen to be a pro. This is my first time investigating a body I once talked to. It is hard for you after all, huh? Tell me. Hey, has got it a million times worse. Losing someone she respects. Hey. Um, is there someone you respect, Kenji? Maybe there was. A message for those in the room. Please exit the room quickly. To allow for retrieval of the corpse. Retrieval of the corpse? Ooh, yeah, Nao doesn't like that. <laughs> Don't be ridiculous! I won't. I won't give the professor to anyone. Defiance will not be tolerated. 
beginning fog dissemination. <laughs> Gaskin. No! Stop! Please stop! The professor isn't dead at all! His health his head fell off, Nao! Hey, Nao took part of Mishima. And put it in the box Kitaro had brought. Oh my god, you gotta be kidding, Nao. What are you doing, Meow? You shouldn't be doing that, Wolf. Please get out of my way. Nao brushed the others aside and took off running. Hold on, Meow. Jim, don't wait. Ah, this is no good. Sarah Jo, let's give chase. Please, Nao lost her cool, so treat her carefully. Gosh, she can't keep the head, though. Uh, where'd she go? Wait, did she go? Oh, no. Oh, Kitaro, I hope you did your job. Please say you did your job, Kitaro. They're not there. Kitaro isn't here. Did he go to the second floor? Fuck. What do we do? It seems really important. We go all go to the second floor, that's gonna trigger the main game. I have a feeling right now, probably fine. Split up and search. Me and him, does that mean just me and him go to the second floor? I think we all, fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. No, if we all go to the second floor, no trigger. Uh, but still, I don't think we need to get split up. No. I'll go to the second floor. No way, what if she's on the first floor? Ah, oh, well fine, it didn't even matter. It didn't even matter. I know she's not on the first floor. She went upstairs and Kataro chased after her. You already know this, man. I'll search down here, you two look upstairs. Please, Kenji. Gotcha. Come back right away if you find her, Sarah. Splitting up is dumb right now. It's just dumb. Let's hurry. Look at this second floor, eh? Lots of doors. Where could she have gone? Come check time real quick. Shit. Getting close to that time, guys, but I gotta know more. I gotta play more. A red SP door. A RO door. A mirror door. M I R door. Wait. So I don't know what SP stands for, but this looks like rock, mirror. SP again. Yellow SP door. Large iron bars block the passage. Start with a row room. What? Jin? Why is he in a cage? <laughs> Big Sis Sarah! Help me out! I was looking for Big Sis Nao! An iron cage. How can we. Uh, I wouldn't go touching that. Oh. Yeah! Big Sis Sarah! Jin! It's sinking lower and lower, meow. No, Wolf. I'm scared. Help me, Big Sis Sarah. I think I have to think. Ah. Uh, I mean, let's see if we can lift the cage. Just don't fucking get your fingers cut off, please. Kenji, please hold on to the other side. Get me out of here! Jin! Age stopped, completely buried in the ground. Ah, Jin! It's not budging. What should I do? There, maybe? Huh? Yep, yeah, it's the ladder. This way, sir. I don't really want to go down there. Guess I have to at this point. 
What the fuck is going on? Okay, I'm saving. I'm saving. This is not gonna be good. Although, whatever happens, happens, like I said. A green switch. Shouldn't go carelessly touching anything else. Yes. I don't really touch anything by even walking in here, to be honest. This appears to be a computer screen. I'm lousy with machines. Something's written here. Birdcage game. Free the bird hostage in the cage. Hold down the green switch to raise output to maximum. Don't let your guard down. Wicked Mask will come kill those pressing the switch. Wicked Mask? What? Come kill those? Shine a holy light on the mask and wait for an opportunity to keep holding. Oh fuck, are you serious? Right, so we just have to hold down this button. If mask appears, let go and shine holy light? That's weird. Wonder what light it means. Ah, there's a flashlight below the machine. Ah, that'd be our holy light. Okay. Of a flashlight. Regular flashlight that shines holy light. A green switch. I guess we have to, I mean. No, not yet, not yet. Jin, are you okay? Yeah, he's he's panicking. He's in full blown panic mode. Yeah, okay. Well, let's do it, I guess. Go ahead and press the button. What? Looks like it's starting. I just gotta click them. I think I just gotta click them. Oh my god, they hit me? God damn, I do not have the mouse space to be doing this. I do not have the mouse space to be doing this! I do not have the fucking mouse! What happened? Jump scare. Game over. Wow. I am glad I saved. Let's try this again. Let me clear off some more fucking mouse space. Oh my god, come on. Alright. Gotta put up sensitivity to maximum too, holy shit. Alright. Green switch. Uh, okay, I gotta do the whole damn thing over again. Yeah, we are. we know he's okay. Let's read the computer screen. And we already know what it says. Skip all that. I gotta be so quick, too. Maybe I'm just slow. Press it. Alright. We got it this time, guys. No problem. Oh god, that's so sensitive. That's way too sensitive. Oh god, fix it. Fix it. There we go. So much better. Perfect. I got this now. I got this now. I got this. I got this. I don't got this. I don't got this. I'm sucking. I'm sucking ass. I'm sucking all the ass. Come on. Come on. Gotta get the kid out of here. Gotta get the kid out. Gotta get the kid out. Gotta get the kid out. Come on, Sarah. You got it. You got it. Okay. Come on, Sarah. You got it. I have the tiger. Will the fight. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Okay. That's only one hit. That's only one hit. It's nothing. You can take one hit all day. I take one hits every day. Okay, got them all, got them all. Come on, come on. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, hit me again. No! 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 Okay, just focus on the mask. I got all the time in the world, right? What's happening? Almost like glitching out. That was weird. All the time in the world. All the time in the world. Literally all the time. What the fuck, really? That is... Why is that so hard? I just want to know why that's so hard, guys. Okay, well, I'm gonna save after all the dialogue in case I have to do this several times. I really don't want to edit this shit, but I guess I will if I have to. Let's see... I mean, as far as I'm concerned, maybe the kid's just dead at this point. 
I know I'm dead. All right, this time we'll save in case we gotta do another attempt. Okay, green switch, perfect. Maybe if I panic less, that would probably be good. Panicking less would be a good idea. Oh, it's all good. Boom, boom, boom. There's like, they come in threes, right? It's, no, it's whenever I go to the damn button they come. See, I go to the button and there's just a new one. If I don't go to the button, they won't come. Just focus. Focus for fuck's sake. This is why I don't play shooters. I suck ass at pointing and clicking. Alright. What the hell? Are you serious with that? I gotta, like, trick the masks. I gotta trick the masks, right? I gotta be like, oh, I'm going for it. Oh, I'm going for it. Oh, I'm going for it. Look at me. I'm pushing the button. I'm pushing the button. Yeah, that's it. I got it now. I have no idea. I have no idea. There's like one, seems to be one bugged one every round. It's gonna try and be tricky right here, yep. Yep. Got him. Got him. Phew, can he be freed now? Hmm, the flashlight stopped working too. Oh well. Jin, can you open it up and come down? Jin? Yeah. That was scary. It's okay now. And she picked up the trembling Jin and set him down. Fix his Sarah. Jin drove into my chest. Jin, it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> now, let's get the hell out of here. Great, so are other people going to be stuck in the other rooms in horrible death traps? I have a feeling that is going to be a case, but you know, guys, I think that is all the time I have for today. So I just want to say that again, thank you all so much for watching. If you liked it, go ahead and leave a like, drop me a comment, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye!